Hey everyone, uh, Nick again. I'm here to recap the top 12 idle girls. I'm gonna kind of rush through this because my camera is really being annoying today. <clears throat> so let's just get right to it. Worst, in my opinion, was Haley Johnson saying sweet dreams from the Arrhythmics. Randy called it a nightmare, and <laughs> I agree completely. He also sort of offhandedly said it was train wrecky, which I agree with as well. Number 11. You're all gonna hate me for it. You're all gonna disagree. You're all gonna say I'm tone deaf. You're gonna say I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't care. I hated every second of Elise Test Tone's performance. Hated it. Hated it. Hated it. Hated it. Hated that she was singing the same song Jen Hurst sang earlier. Hated that it was yet another Adele song. Hated her shrieky vocals. Everything. Especially the judges' praise. Hated the judges' praise of it. Ten Bailey Brown. I like her, but she really let me down. She was singing Amazed from Lone Star, which is a great song, but it wasn't very good. I mean, it wasn't terrible, but it wasn't great. It wasn't as good as it should have been. Uh, <clears throat> number nine, Chelsea Sorrell, or Sorrell, whatever. I didn't really care enough to catch how it was pronounced. Number eight, Brielle Von Hugel. I don't like her, but it was all right, I guess, in the end. It wasn't as good as the judges thought, but in my opinion, anyway. But it was okay, I guess. Uh, seven, Skylar Lane. They didn't really do anything for me either way. But I guess it was alright. I can see her being a wild card pick. Six, Hallie Day. Good performance, but feeling good is another song that should be retired from these shows. Number five, um, Jen Hurst singing the song Elise sang, but singing it a million times better, in my opinion. Uh, four, Jessica Sanchez. She was singing with a sore throat, which really surprised me because she worked right through it didn't even sound like it uh three shannon mcgrain i didn't think i'd be uh voting for her. i thought she'd just be a red shirt contender she'd just go away quickly but she surprised me uh two erica van pelt she's a local girl to me she's from rhode island i'm from massachusetts so yeah i, I kind of have to vote root for her but regardless of that she really was very good and i was a fan i definitely really liked it and the best in my opinion Another one I didn't really expect, Holly Cavanaugh. And I mean, I'd seen her before, but I didn't really care about her. And she sang Reflection from Christina Aguilera, another song that should be retired, but she made it sound really good. And uh, that's uh, the top five girls, in my opinion, should be well, my top five that I said, but I think, I don't think Shannon will make it, unfortunately. I think it'll be Hallie, Hallie Day instead. But, I mean, I, I'm okay with that. Hallie's really good, too. And so, uh, that's it, and I got through this without my camera annoying me. So, see you tomorrow with my thoughts on the results.